Welcome to a short tutorial for testing your memory with MemTest. MemTest has been around for ages and is considered the gold standard when it comes to finding out if your RAM is faulty and causes blue screens or not. Simply go to memtest86.com and download the zip file. Extract it to the location of your choice and open the image usb.exe file. You should now select a USB stick to write the MemTest image to. Please note that the USB stick will be formatted, so all of the files on it will be lost. Make sure to save those files in advance. Then proceed with writing the image and don't change any of the other options shown. The program will notify you once the operation has finished and the stick is ready. Now comes the fun part. Reboot your system and make sure it boots from the USB drive. In order to do that, you have to enter the BIOS and change the boot priority. Depending on your mainboard manufacturer, you have to press F2, F8, F9 or delete to open the BIOS. If you are in doubt, consult the manual for your mainboard. As you can see here on my laptop, I can simply swap out the USB drive and put it as the number one boot device. Save the made changes and exit the BIOS and MemTest will now boot from your newly created USB drive. You can see various options. You should make sure that all of the tests, the magic number is 13, are selected. Also make sure that all of your CPU cores are being used, to speed up the process at least a little bit. Now all that's left to do is start the test process and lean back and of course hope for the best. Please note that by default those 13 tests will be run 4 times, meaning there will be 4 passes. Depending on your system speed, the amount of RAM you have and its respective speed, one pass could take between 15 and 16 minutes. Eventually you want to see that your RAM passed MemTest. Obviously if you had blue screens and MemTest does not show any errors, you need to go a different route. Maybe your CPU overheats, your power supply is a bit janky under load or you have some mainboard issues. Testing your CPU for stability can also be done pretty easily. Simply check the info cards for another video. So this is how you test your RAM with MemTest in a nutshell. Like this video if you liked it, subscribe to help the channel and we will see you in the next one.